the persistent rise in the prices of foods and commodities in the country has been attributed to insecurity in most of the farmlands across Nigeria. The Ale Muslim of Ife land, Alaji Bikunu Dawa, discussed this while addressing journalists on the legal problems associated with the increase in the prices of food and commodities. Problems of uh, human insecurity, food insecurity, these two problems, they are like twins, Taiwan kind, they, they go together. One will, will affect the other. Uh, but unfortunately for us in this country, we have all the necessary legislation, models, starting with our law. If we follow our law, we will not be in this situation again, no, no, now. Alaji Lawa, who is Baba Adeni of Faso State, also identified non-implementation of Nigerian urban planning law, which, according to him, could have so frequent classes between farmers and elders. It's probably why the, the Nigerian urban Nigeria planning law is not being implemented. So what we should do now is to go back to, you know, to implement, if possible, there may be a state of emergency that's, that's planning. That law provides for planning authorities at federal level, state level, local level. Alaji Lawa urged stakeholders in the agricultural sectors in the country to adopt the Obafemi Awolowo Farm Settlement Policy that will encourage young Nigerians to go into farming. You know, farm, 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 farm settlements, where people were, were, were doing farming, they were producing food, yam, potato, cocoa yam, all sorts of food. In simple economics, what you are now undergoing, Simple economies, demand and supply. Demand is rising. Supply is going down. The price will continue to, to, to rise. We've not, we, we've not reached there. If you are not careful, everybody will, will, will leave a town and go, go to the bush, you know, looking for, 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 for food. On education, Alaji Lawar appealed to federal and state government to change the nation's educational system into vocational studies, which, according to him, who made Nigerian youth to be self-employed. From Ileife, Rotimi Akama, NTA News.